Hi, I'm Emma. And I'm Leah. And we're seniors here at the high school, and this is Dear Freshman. Yeah, we started the series because as seniors we wanted to answer some questions and give some advice to freshmen and underclassmen who are just coming into high school and don't really know what's going on. So we asked some of our friends who have questions and are curious <laughs> about things, and we're going to give our wisdom to you because we are so wise. Yes. So, do you want to start? The first question is, is it worth going all out for Spirit Week? Hmm. Thoughts and opinions? Um, I'm not going to lie, this year, I, before Spirit Week I would have said yes, go all out, do everything, oh, yeah. uh -huh. like literally like, if you look stupid it doesn't matter, but then like, you show up to school and then like, no one else is doing it, Yeah. and you're like, oh This my year gosh. was different, not many people did yeah. it, but in the past, I remember showing up my freshman room like, nobody's going to do it, Yeah. and everybody was decked out, yeah. I think, I think it's so worth going out for it, it just really depends on the themes though, Yeah. if the themes are worth it. Yeah, but. The theme, I think the themes that I liked, I dressed up for, I think there were like a, a few, maybe one or two days mm -hmm. I didn't dress up, but the other ones, like even if it's just like a holiday, like wear yeah. like a Christmas sweater, like even it doesn't have to be crazy. Yes. But also like, no one's judging you. No, that's what, that's what I was saying. You know? I was thinking about that. <laughs> just reading your mind. Yes. Yeah, so so like, we're so insane. Nobody's gonna judge you because right. that's that's what you're supposed to do this week. Yeah, totally. Like yeah. if you are wearing, like I saw someone wearing like a pit bull outfit. Or yeah. I don't even remember what was the theme that day. Honestly, I know, I know I know who it was. She probably just wanted to wear her pit bull <laughs> outfit, Kylie. <laughs> That's exactly who it was. Um, so if you, we should just have a pit bull theme day. Yeah. Everyone dresses yeah. pit bull. Right. If that's a theme day, definitely do that. Okay, next one. Moving on. How do you balance sports and clubs? That's a good question. Yeah. Uh, I play soccer and I'm in a club and I think you just need to talk to your coach about it and they should be really understanding of like you and your academics and that usually you should have put school first yeah. and I think clubs is part of school mostly yeah. so I think they should all totally be totally understanding of it if you come to practice late you'll still be at practice right you really I really haven't missed much of anything no I didn't have to miss I also I run cross country so yeah. I was I'm in a sport too and I feel like it depends on what clubs you're in sometimes like the after school and sports like it, it sometimes yeah. kind of messes with it I was fortunate to have like one of my clubs like it was on the off day that like we did That's practice nice. so it was really nice but I know a lot of coaches are like okay like they're not it's not like the best thing in the world but like they're understanding like yes. you said and they're like it's fine so I guess balancing it just like it's not too prioritize I would say join know? a club like don't worry about that just yes. join it yeah join a club and it's also like this isn't if you feel passionate about something do it but it also looks really good on when you're applying to colleges yeah. to be a part of something for four years is just like and it's cool when you meet so many people and I think clubs are unique because you're not with them like necessarily every day yeah. but you're meeting new people. Yeah. So. Okay. Next question. How much are teachers against using your phones? <laughs> this is so interesting because yeah. when the freshmen, some of the freshmen that gave us these questions, um, when they asked us this, they were like, at the middle school, like, what were they That's saying? That's crazy. They said that like you couldn't even have it out in the hallways. Yeah, they were like, no phone zones. Like yeah. if they saw it even out in your bag, they would take it. Like. That's just not a thing. But, uh, I would say, okay, so my freshman, I would say. my freshman year, I think they were a lot more strict, like, hey, don't have your phone out in class, but never, like, in the hallways, but I think as, like, we, we've, like, as time has gone on, I don't, teachers aren't as strict, and I, I think technology has just improved. I was gonna say. You have to, yeah. sometimes I, like, have to use my phone in class, or just stuff like that, so right. I, I don't think it really matters as much anymore. Just make sure you're focused on your class. Right, like, like, as long as you're focused, you yeah. know, just, like, texting or going through your feed or whatever. Yeah. Um, yeah, but I thought that was interesting because it just is not like that at all. Yeah, at school. not at all. Obviously be respectful, but. Yeah. All right, next question was one of our freshman friends said, what do seniors really think of us? Um, I think you're like everybody else. Yeah, you're awesome. I don't, we love you. Yeah, I don't, I don't see it as like a huge like gap. Like, yeah. oh my gosh, they need to find their place, I think. You're just like everyone else. No, I agree. I think some people are like, oh, stupid freshmen. Yeah. Like, I, I don't know. But I just have empathy because I feel like I was just there. Me <laughs> too. Um, I feel like I was just there and like, I don't know. I'm not like walking through the halls looking for like, oh, like, where's the fresh meat? Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, I'm not, I'm I'm not, not like, I can't like pick out, oh my gosh, that kid is a freshman. Yeah. I Obviously, if they're like, oh my gosh, voice crack, do you hear that? <sighs> you just need to take a moment. I'm just gonna say, if I like come across someone that's like really immature or I'm like in a class with someone that just is like acting like they're like 
literally insane. Yeah. I can sometimes just pinpoint, maybe you're a little younger on the younger end and you yeah. have empathy. So like, I think most nice seniors or upperclassmen are like, oh, we have empathy, we get it. You're we're just, fresh. you're figuring yourself we were, out. We were all in your spot. So right. I think there's no reason to judge. No, we literally, like, in one of our classes that we're in together, like, yeah. they're underclassmen <laughs> near us, and we're like, oh, that was, it's, look at that. I was like, that was, was me. Them. Yeah, that, that was us. us. That was us. So. Thank you for watching. That's all for this episode. We'll see you We'll next see you week. next time. See ya. Bye.